Look at Jen, bro. Jen is mad cute. He can do camera? Jen looks like one of them prairie dogs. We're not making it across. What about, Jen kind of looks like that squirrel in that one thing where he's like, Yeah, this one. Wait a minute. Hold on. Does this Lodi come in? Is it Dude, I never know. I never know. Chat, when does Loadout come in and mass for surges, bro? Do any of you know? I'm about to tee off on him. I'm gonna win. Three, two, one, go. Down. Nice. Your team has entered the safe zone. I didn't even hit him once. It's caramel, it's not caramel. If you say it like caramel, you just like, you know what I mean? You just love to hear yourself talk or something. Is that what it is? Like you like hearing yourself? Caramel. Jed, did Tim tell you guys that he fell off his golf cart? Did he tell you all about that? The fat ass, fa he FaceTimes me. And he got a scratch on his head, his elbows bleeding. His pinky toe looks fractured, but it's not. It's just his pinky toes go like, you know, like if these were your toes, you know, and they're going how they're supposed to be going, you got like a little, like a little bend or something. But the pinky toes just go like this. <laughs> it's crazy. They, they go, they just go out. They're like, they're running away, man. The pink, well, here's what happened, man. All the toes got together. You know, it was probably during night, Tim sleeping. The toes grouped up and they had a conversation and they, and they said, listen, man, the right toe said to the big toe, I can't do this shit no more. The inner right toe was like, yo, me neither, fam. I'm, I'm, I'm hurting. My back hurts. My, my, my sides hurt. My ribs hurt. The other guy was like, yo, I think we should just maybe do something. And the pinky toe, he realized that he was on the outside of the foot and he's not needed as much. So he just took it upon himself. Both pinky toes said, yo, fuck this shit. And just went outward. Pinky toes gave up. Like a dude in Buds is not carrying his weight with the head of the boat. Started ducking his head. Literally crazy. That's what happened. It's science. You know, Chad, in 50 years, human beings are not going to have pinky toes. We don't need them anymore. Have you seen LeBron's pinky toe? One of the most athletic people that ever existed on planet Earth. Have you seen his pinky toe? It grew over his foot. We don't use them anymore. Okay? We're not going to... You literally need it, don't you? No, Joe, we're going to get rid of it. I'm Listen, in 50 years, motherfuckers are going to start being born with eight toes. I had to think about that. Eight toes. For balance? Nah, man, you don't need that damn toe, bro. I told him, they told me do nothing. I see you in 50. I see you in 50. I will see you in 50. And we'll talk about it. Pull up Tim's stream. What's he doing? Your head was still bleeding. I was worried about you. Yeah, yeah, was yeah. His head was yeah. bleeding. His toe was cut open, bro. Yeah, it was bad. Yeah, I told he you. He nailed the curve. Yeah, of course. Yeah, I went <laughs> no, to the doctor to make sure I didn't have a concussion and stuff like that. You know what I mean? So. Dude, and the worst part is, like, he fell out. And when he fell out, it wasn't bad. But then he got dragged for, like, two feet. And I was You're like, making oh, it God. seem like I was, I was fine. Oh, <laughs> my God. I was fine, you everyone. You had a cut on your head that was bleeding. It was a little... Was Chad, it was a surface-level cut, bro. <laughs> He's Tim, gassing Tim, it. No, Tim, oh, can I have another this? beer? We, we, yeah. Bro, <laughs> I was just talking about this on stream. No way. Yo, Tim, you almost died? <laughs> nah, you could have died to fall there, which was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I landed. Two down, two down. Another team, another team pulled up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right here, right here. Right there, by the by. Hostile UAV active. Shut up, so bad. Oh, I said whore, bitch. Clock, you a bitch, bro. Don't forget it, all right? I ain't playing around today. You wanna know how you, you, you ever tune into my stream, Clock? You wanna know why I'm not playing around? This win. You see this thing? You see this thing? You see that shit? 
I'm on my fucking Pidgeotto shit right now, bro. Don't fuck with me, man. Don't fuck with me today. I ain't playing no games, man. The rooster's here. Uh, yeah, I'll show you the ranks here. Last question about it. Here is the ranks in Call of Duty Warzone. On the bottom, we are right here. Getting ready to punch into Crimson 2. I, I kind of feel like the games will be pretty easy with the three of us. I, I think the games will be pretty easy throughout the whole way. I mean I, I mean, I guess maybe if we got the top 250, it might get a little bit harder because it just takes so much SR away from you. It'd be really unforgiving. But I know that we're already in the big lobby, so it's like, you know, it is what it is. The Apex equivalent, this would be, what would this be? I'm in three, and then you got 10K, and then you, and then you have Pred, right? It's a good rank system, man. It's a good rank system. I mean, I really like it. I think it, it it's definitely, I hope they don't make it easier because I like the challenge. Now I know for those guys like Aiden and stuff like that, I mean, it's gonna be hard to get those guys like a, a good challenge unless they're in a tournament, but it's still fun. Only three ranks per, right? Three ranks per until we get to Iridescent and then it's just like, you know, based on your SR. The same way Apex is. After you get to 10K, you're just, you know what I mean? This rank is, I'm telling you, the rank system is really good. The rank system is really, really good. Not a fan of this game, but a fan. Dude, I don't fuck with the game either, man. But the rank mode, I don't know, man. Bro, imagine we had a rank mode in Warzone 1. I just keep thinking about it, man. Like, this shit for dance would have hit different, bro. God, this shit would have hit different. It's hitting different as is. And I'm on the new one, man. Because, you know, we would have been all been fiending on that fucking quarantine bullshit. Just with our eyes crossed playing this shit. We've been going nuts. <laughs> Dude, you wouldn't have been able to get me off that game, bro. No way. Cream off Superstore for real. Oh my God, man. Back window. Cox out for Harambe. Oh, dude, that game was so fun, man. Suck my ass. Would not even know what an Apex Pro is if Warzone 1 had ranked. <laughs> Isn't that funny? You know, chat, you know sometimes people come in and like, bro, Nick, you know, you're mad late to Apex. And I'm like, huh, what? What are you talking about? I'm perfect time on Apex. You, you were playing Apex. Fine. Got it. Wait, do you know what we were doing? We were in Verdansk, bro. You don't even have any idea what you missed out on, apparently. And then before Verdansk, you know what we were doing? We were in Tilted Towers, bro, while you're playing Apex, man. We're not the same. Currently, it's arguably, I can make a pretty damn good case, Apex is in the best state it's ever been. And now we're in Apex, you're right. So call me good timing mercs, man, all right? Cause, cause y'all dumbasses missed out on fucking Tilted and Verdansk while I had the time of my life and showed up late to the party and had all the cake, man. So I, I don't know what, I don't know what we're arguing about. You know what I mean? They come into my chat all the time. Yo, Nick, Wraith season one. Like, dude, yeah, right. I was in fucking Tilted. Like, don't talk to me. I'm literally in Greasy fucking Grove, man. Low key, we waited for Fortnite to kind of go to shit. Honestly, <laughs> we jumped over to Warzone. Warzone kind of went to shit, jumped over to Apex. Both Preparation Warzone and time. Apex are trying to, to compete to with Apex ranked, so they're like throwing out their, their rank modes and shit. We're like, oh shit, we'll dabble, we'll dabble. Okay, you don't understand what you're talking about here. <laughs> 